The final touch deftly applied by Jerry Craney and Celtic are one up. It was from this move that Celtic scored the second. Brian O'Neill's pass puts the Montrose defence in all kinds of trouble. And Tommy Coyne takes full advantage, scoring the second goal in two minutes. Celtic finally scored the third five minutes before half-time, started by Brian O'Neill. And finished by Tommy Coyne. And that's number two for Craney. That was Jerry Craney's hat-trick and Tommy Coyne wasn't going to be outdone, even if he had to rely on help from substitute Tony Cascarino's powerful challenge.